Well, so moving on, and in uh, reports monitored on an Accra-based radio station indicated that uh, robbers are taking advantage of the ongoing Easter celebrations at Quo in the eastern region. According to reports, the development is taking the shine of the annual event. Some of the robbers reportedly attacked revelers on their way home, whilst other gangs engage in isolated operations in communities around. A lot of people reportedly complained of missing phones, iPads and monies in spite of the heavy security presence. The police say a number of the suspected robbers have been arrested and would be prosecuted after the screening. The report said the police had called for reinforcement but cautioned revelers to be responsible for their security. And so on the phone line to throw more light on the issue is Director of Police Public Affairs Department, uh, Superintendent Cephas Arthur. Good afternoon and thanks for joining us here. Uh, can you confirm that there has been series of robberies at Quo? Thank you and good afternoon. I can say that we didn't record even one robbery incident uh, at Quo. Quo uh, was very, very peaceful. Uh, more peaceful than last year because of the security arrangement put in place. However, there were some petty thievery uh, and petty crimes like uh, uh, mobile phone stealing and those kind of things. That is what we can call any crime that we recorded. And one or two assaults. And uh, we also made arrest of a uh, uh, 23 vehicles that were using DV and DP number plates. These are just a few incidents. There are 12 little, little cases, and uh, they are the only cases that were recorded uh, in Kong. And so it is never true that uh, there was any robbery case. Well, so um, how serious were, were, were these uh, uh, theories, as you put it? Hello? I'm asking how serious this situation is because ahead of the uh, easter festivities uh, the police uh, promised maximum security especially at school so if this happened we want to find out how serious was it yeah the, the situation was very calm because of the as i indicated earlier the pretty arrangement that we put in place prior to the incident and uh, because of some experience that the police and the assistant security agencies uh, at heart, uh, as a result of a long period of uh, uh, managing the situation at the top there, we had the military also available supporting the police to maintain law and order. Uh, we were able to map up a very comprehensive security arrangement to maintain law and order. Uh, if you if you came to Kwewu and listened to the people, everybody was saying that uh, this year's Kwewu Easter has been more peaceful everybody was praising the security agencies and so i can say that uh, the police and their sister security agencies lived up to expectation and money to uh, maintain law and order at the place as we speak uh, the crowd is turning down yesterday was about a climax and today everybody is passing to their various uh, destinations so life could come to normal we still have police personnel there maintaining law and order and ensuring that everything comes to a zero degree uh, before maybe uh, the security arena will be reviewed and handed over to the Nkoko Division of well, uh, thanks so much uh, for joining us on the line. I have been speaking with uh, Superintendent Sefas Arthur, Director of Public Affairs of the Ghana uh, Police Service.